Hi and welcome. My name is Chowa and we're playing Neo Cap. Let's continue. As all suggested, I tracked down Savi's boyfriends, a DJ named Chase and a techie named Charlie. It was a long shot, but maybe one or both of them took Neo Cap. I opened the Neo Cap app like it was going to give me some answers. Nope, at least now I knew a few friendly faces at this city. Hopefully, one of them need a ride as badly as I need some leads. Let's see what we have here. Nice. Daily goals. Okay, it's the beginning of the day. Journal. Let's see. We will finish you. Who is this? This Capra and this? Okay, we are here. Wait, what? I was here last time. No. Wait. Four, eight. No, it seems okay. Okay. Then this guy. Ooh. Okay. Una Saint Clair. Okay, let's go with Una. Hi, Una slid into the back seat. Hello again. Any progress on um rolling that hot thirteen? We really need to get you to a casino <laughs> casino, but yes, I've made some progress. Uh, I'm now gathering more information. Which is why you're heading to... Is this right? City Hall? Yeah, they're announcing where the new municipal spaceport is going to be built. At midnight, very dramatic. Here's... Hoping they announce the choice with the balloon drop. That would be unexpected indeed. So there are three neighborhoods being considered, or maybe I should say threatened. The world is about to change for one of them. And suddenly of that magnitude has a very strong feeling. Yeah, it's called with Tread. Yeah, it's called Tread. Not quite. Dread and hope both anticipate an outcome and taint the pure uncertainty. It's difficult to fi find large groups of people generating this kind of energy. The nurses shoo me away when I hang around the hospital. Large-scale sporting events are an option, of course, but I've learned the hard way to regard my own comfort as an essential variable. I wonder if my worry about Savi was beating her. I, it felt gross, like she was a vulture for those moments in life when you feel small and helpless. I know what you're thinking. Uh, good, because the whole thing is kind of weird. You're wondering if you should take Oblit or Isidore Street. You'll take both. I highly doubtful. Oh, the timer will branch in... Wait for it. Una waited. My body tensed up. I held my breath. 
and totally missed the turn onto Isidore Street. There, did you feel it? The literal branching of timelines? No. I believe he will someday. I felt it. It was a falling sensation, followed by the faintest thump. One version of this cab went down Isidore Street, another down Oblit. I'm glad to be us, but I need the other versions of Una and Lina now. No ill will. Oh, don't look at me like that. So, you really think that's uh, how it all works? Of course I do. Because it does. I have the, what did my mother used to say? Recep, receipts. I'm sorry, I can't help myself. Quantum statisticians can be annoying this way. So I have a question. I know you're into randomness and entropy, but... What do you get out of fixing reality? That's a fair question. Fixing reality is strictly a hobby. I'm a little embarrassed to say it, but mostly I get paid to recover best phrases. That's it? It's not easy. Well, it's a little bit easy for me. I just thought we'd do more once we'd cracked multiple dimensions, like... Like... Stable video chat, world peace, translating animal language. Stable video chat, world peace. Yeah. We've looked into that and, trust me, no one wants to live in that waking nightmare. Dreadful. Just awful. Cool job. Yours isn't bad, either. You know, you live closer than most to the quantum realm. How so? You choose your passengers, don't you? I do. Each choice is a branch. That other version of you with that other passenger, she exists. I'm not sure if you're up on your date currently theory, but it's been proven. Why aren't I her and vice versa? That's exactly the right question, my dear. Most people don't ask the right question. You could be quite good at this. She didn't have to. <laughs> she didn't have to sound quite so surprised. I could teach you if you had access to a. Uh, Five hundred twelve qubit quantum compiler. And assuming you knew your foundational statistics, of course, and had twenty hours a week for problem sets. So, I'm not going to learn how to be a witch, is what I'm hearing. hearing. Huh. Perhaps not quite yet. Anyway, uh, it's all more complicated these days. When I started, the compilers only had 32 qubits, if you can believe it. Oh. 
I nodded. You didn't shrug. You could have shrugged. The way the world branches in the tiniest ways. It's interesting, isn't it? I was starting to feel weird. Paralyzed. Every choice, not just every choice, every action. Not just every action, every thought. What is decision even? A choice from a menu of options, a stumble down the path of least resistance, a little bit of magic. The space between considering a choice and deciding on one, it was too much to really look at, like staring at the sun. It's a miracle on one any decision ever happened at all. My head felt like it was going to explode. I was dealing with way too much other uncertainty in my reality to process this. It must be exhausting to be Una. Una tapped the back of my seat. Hello. Sorry, zoomed out for a second there. I was saying, get ready for it. For what? Una looked out the window. There's the other versions of us, the Una and Lina that took Isidore Street. They'll merge with us in a moment. Wait for it. Wait. I wonder what kind of conversation they had. Maybe they are halfway to Vegas by now. That is a very different timeline, my dear. Not a bad one, though. Una shuddered. It was like a wave passed through her. There. That was it. I didn't know what I felt. Either way, we were at City Hall. The timelines have merged again. It always makes me feel better, like I have a little more of myself. I'll need it all to handle this announcement. There's going to be yelling. Wait. How do we make decisions? I'm a quantum statistician, not a neurobiologist, biologist. Hormones, cosmic rays, maybe there's some benevolent force unknown to our physics. Not God, not God, exactly, just some decider. Like me? She slid out of the car and dashed toward City Hall, slipping between knots of protesters gathered outside. They were all filled up, chanting and waving signs in the middle of the night. It made sense they were fighting for their homes. I wonder what would happen if Una told them they would fail and also succeed. Would everyone just give up and leave? Una perched on the stage near the podium, dropped a blanket over her legs and closed her eyes. I wished her luck. Okay, the next one, please. Four. Tonight's Lina is a fascinating possibility space not fully manifested. Oh, great. Thanks, Una. Uh, pick up request. I'm here. Fiona Buck. Whoa, Gideon the Cop. First they ignore you, then they laugh at you, then they fight you, then you win. Gideon the Cop. Who is this? Who is this Gideon? 
Fiona Park, Anthony Colton. Sam Lucas, just setting up my Neo Cap. Okay, let's go over this. Gideon the Call. Who is this guy? A vault is a dark shot me a look as I pulled outside the ground. A wallet in a dark shot me a look as I pulled outside the ground. You arts pillars of the low Babylon. Hello. Really, someone in this at this place? Then I saw her, a short figure with the bulk of a boxer, stalking down the red carpet towards me. The cameras went wild for her, their flashes reflected in hard metal skin. She screened back into the blade and flipped them the bird. Lights to of being neon dotted her spine. What was she? Please let her be human. Yep, she is. Are you kidding me? Hello, please take her on your car? They didn't really give me a choice. I believe that. I literally just came from a hotel full of LOPD. Definitely not a robot, but she couldn't have been more than maybe 13. You're not gonna catch me dead at a charity ball for cops ever again. Same. They're the worst. Oh, I see you're making fun of me. No, no, I wasn't. Whatever. Who was this kid? Famous? Super rich? Should I be calling her ma'am? Rough night? Kid, ma'am. Okay, let's see. Rough night, kid. Terrible. Yikes. So why were you at the charity ball for cops? Oh, technic okay, technically it wasn't for cops, but they were hosting it, or whatever. Just one more corrupt cock in the machi machine to pass Sophie's law. Oh, crap, I'm really sorry to bring up Sophie's law to you. Don't worry, I absolutely do not support it. I've never picked anyone up from that hotel before? You go to the Babylon often? Hell no, only when my mom needs me for a Sophie's Law photo op. Wait, what's your mom have to do with Sophie's Law? Oh god, sorry, in advance? So Capra wants to own everything and everyone, right? Anywhere we go, anything we say, they want it all. Sophie's Law gets them most of the way there. It outlaws human drivers within laws or just auto cars only. You know, to keep us safe. I'm aware of it. Oh yeah, of course you are. Anyways, my fascist mother's pushing it hard. The referendum is up for a vote any day now. She set up a fake charity to hide all the political donations. Anyway, I went and she introduced me to the chief of police. And he was like, ooh, nice to meet you. And I said, freak out, white supermassist. I bet your mom was thrilled. Yancy tried to pull me away, but you know, look what I'm wearing. Then she said I was embarrassing her, so I left. It's true though, did you know that institution can be institutions can be racist, racist? Sorry, of course you do, I don't have to tell you how bad the LOPD is for people of color. Uh, 
I let that one go. It's very fascist. So you're against everything your mom stands for. Was she a bit controlling as a parent? Totally. Wait, how do you know? You're dressed in a pink Iron Maiden. Of course you couldn't just not mention it. Okay, so this is... A uh, Kinder Mac. It's the Michelle model, which they make specially for girls. Yancy would want you to know that it's, it's the Slimline model. I can't even talk about that. I've never heard of a Kinder Mac. I'm not surprised, it's super expensive. I'm not out on the poverty line here, Gideon. Oh god, sorry, that's not what I meant. I sound just like her, all she talks about is money, like it's the only thing in life. Yancy put me in this when I was four, after I got hit by the car. But I was fine after the surgery, she totally overreacted. But she got it, so if it happened again, like that happens to anybody twice. I wouldn't even feel it. Can you take it off? Not until I'm 18. Really? Don't you know? That's when you're officially old enough to make your own decisions, apparently. How is that legal? That is what I've been saying my whole life. I tried getting em emancipated, you know? But the courts in this country are terrified of Yancy. Just because my family has money. It's so sick and fascist. What does it feel like? It's torture. She always knows where I am, she can check it wherever, whenever she wants. There's a camera in here, she can see what I'm looking at. I tried to pierce my ears once and my arms locked in place. I even tried to put this freak fascism, fascism sticker on and it peeled right off the chases, there's a content filter. How do you know when even uh, how do you even know what the faces it fascist is? Try growing up with a woman who makes you use a different fork for each course. I'm joking. I know my crap, you wanna test me on my activism? Go ahead, you lose. You must be able to take it off to sleep at least. No, I can't take it off. Ever. So unfair. Yeah, it's pretty extreme. Right? Why doesn't anyone else see that? Where do you live anyway? You'll see it. Over the last few minutes the streets had gotten cleaner, the buildings around us, us had gotten taller and the people. Actually there wasn't a soul in sight. This is me. We pulled up to high rise with a titanium gate edged with lions. Hey Athena, open gate. 
The lights on her suit boost and the gate creaked open. Okay, sorry, but that was kinda cool. Oh, look at this. I just got a message from Yancy. Thanks, thank you at least for going home and not to your aunt's or god knows where. We'll talk in the morning in the meantime. Think about your political opinions. You'll be more persuasive using reasoned arguments. Persuasive? Rather than ob obscene outbursts. What crap? It's bullshit, right? Your mom kind of has a point. You're right to be angry, but you can always fly off the handle. I'm sure your family didn't become powerful by burning bridges. Oh, come on. People eat polite. Whatever. Do you think like a soldier wins wars by being polite? That's what you are? That's what I am. God, of all people I thought you'd get it. If we stay quiet and Safi's law passes, you'll have no job, you know? Maybe she had a point. I just... oh, never mind. Sorry. As I watched her near the arch dub double doors, I got the awful sense that it was the Sui that was doing the walking, not her. I waited to make sure she got inside okay as if anything could hurt her. She looked back at me before she, the gate slammed shut. At least I think she did. It happened so quickly. Okay. Four stars again. Two? Doesn't get it at all. Great. First warning. Great. Hey Lina, thanks again for the ride, great talking to you. Here's the picture I took at the Safi the Moon Vigil. Do I post? Go for it. Sent. Thank you. Okay, I'll put it up straight away. I think it's a good call. I was maybe being silly earlier. Hope you have a great night. You too. Okay, it was fell well after midnight and I met my right quarter. Where you met your right quarter? I checked my field grid red. I had in time to push a one for one more ride tonight, if, or I could call it e early and get some rest to push on. Okay, let's go. Map. I'm here. Is this? Klausberg. Insufficient charge eh, for everyone, I think. Oh no, it's so expensive. One eighty seven, one thirty eight. Nope, then I can go only here. Each bar would set me back 
full charge. Yep. Let's continue. Um, Stella Bunuel. Lausberg. Lausberg. Student of the world, any opinions expressed on this feed are mine and mine alone. Okay. Carlos Wong. Okay, I like that he is here where I sleep, so let's go with him. He entered again on the full speed. He flashed the green as soon as he saw me. My stomach flipped, he was kind of handsome. Wait, so it's not... Ah, I tried to ignore it. Like, really handsome. I should have been with Savi by now, drinking to my new life in... Okay, we already... Okay, yeah, it's the first time. So let's make it quick. I don't want to read it again because it was already. Okay, this is it. Legal doctor, okay. Yep. Okay, this is it. Yes? Okay, at least five. Five stars. Yeah, let's sleep. 
and see what choices we have on the other day. Oh, 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 oh. I know who it, who it was. Someone thicker and taller and hairier and thinner and I didn't know what shape I was anymore. I was looking at this body from the outside and then I was looking at, at a lot of them. They piled up on top of me higher and higher. I started to suffocate under the weight of those bodies. My last breath was someone's heel jumped in my mouth like a cork. Nobody saw me die. I woke up covered in sweat. What? What dreams do you have? That's... Maybe she need to change the, the place? And grab a dinosaur on my way out. It was over an hour before I could force myself to eat it. It was actually pretty delicious. I grabbed a dinosaur on my way out. Back to work. Night 4. My fourth night in Los Angeles. It is this my life now? Making just enough coin to scrape by? Never seeing the sun on an endless search for my friend? It was starting to feel surreal, like the moment the camera pans to the dark figure laughing in the doorway, and you just know, oh, she's doomed. I still needed to have a chat with Savi's supposed boy toy Charlie, the one Azu told me about, and the packs matching his description was floating around my map like a pin from the angels. And the packs matching his description. I just needed to get my rating back up to 5 stars if I was going to pick him up. Okay. Start shift, let's see who we have here. So it's this guy? Charlie Elliot? Ogonan Klausberg. Oh, great. Okay, I think that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Smash like if you did, leave your comments and subscribe. See you in the next videos. Bye!